G'day guys, how are you? A uh, beautiful Monday afternoon here in Auckland. I'm just heading north towards the city to go and catch up with some guys um, and the team to do a few phone calls and a, a bit of strategizing and stuff. So, hey look, just wanted to uh, make the most of my trip up the motorway um, and just do another bit of a live video on another subject which I believe is very um, key or vital uh, to creating uh, your success and that w that word is uh, persistence um, you know I I've said in the title there what will it take um, to be able to succeed in your life and whatever it is that you're pursuing and it's going to take a lot of persistence um, no matter what it is that you whatever it is that you do right now there's going to be a struggle Grant how are you mate Brent Nicholas how are you Nico all good guys on the uh, live feed already but you're yeah, talking about persistence it doesn't matter what it is that you do I know Grant who's just come on there um, now he's a livestock agent I, I was a livestock agent for about 18 months and I remember pulling up driveway after driveway after driveway rejection after rejection after rejection and that takes a lot of guts to be able to do that and I take my hat off to the guys out there uh, I've got a friend of mine, Scotty Gibson Smith down south. He's, uh, you know, uh, goes real hard with the livestock um, agent stuff, and it's because he's persistent. Um, he doesn't let um, things get him down, and, and he can focus on what it is that he what, what he knows what it is that he's trying to achieve. And I think that's where most people fall short. They they take their eye off the prize. The prize might be buying a house. The prize might be going on a holiday. It might be, uh, the prize might be getting fit at the gym. Um, at the, the prize might be um, being able to help your family out. I don't know what that is. Um, you'll know, and uh, that'll be why you're watching these videos, because you've got something inside of you that you're not quite getting, uh, doing what you're doing right now, and you're looking for the next step or the process to get to that. But understand, if you want to become successful in any arena, it's going to take absolute persistence and guts. It doesn't matter what industry that you go into, there's going to be a period of time where you've got to roll your sleeves up and get stuck into it. Um, there's no such thing um, as, a, as a get rich quick scheme. There's no such thing as a, the easy way to the top. Um, there's always going to be a grind in the beginning, and no matter what, and no matter no matter what you go to uh, pursue, there's always going to be that grind or that hard journey in the beginning. But what happens is that once you go through the grind, you start to gather momentum. And once you start to gather momentum, then things get really, really exciting. You know, I know with Bit been developing our business for quite some time, uh, not only in the property, um, but also with the network. And I know, you know, there's been, you know, oh, countless nights, night after night after night out out talking to people talking to people talking to people getting no result getting no result but what happens is after a period of time is you start to gather momentum and all of the work that you start to put into your funnel as such starts to come back and pay you dividends uh, long term so it doesn't matter what it is that you're gonna go and uh, do guys there's gonna be a struggle and the problem is with most people they don't have the guts as soon as things get tough they quit and I, I say this all the time, is we've got a bunch of men out there who aren't behaving like men. They're hiding behind this big facade. I'm buddy a hero, I'm tough, I can beat this person in a fight, whatever the case may be. You go and put them in front of a, uh, for a bit of, reject, uh, bit of rejection and they, and they cry like a little girl. You know, because they're worried about what other people think of them. Because, it, you know, we're all worried about... Um, what the outside world, think, world thinks of us, but really we need to worry about what we think of ourselves and what is what we think. What, what happens when we look in the mirror? If we're happy with ourselves and we're happy with where we're going, then we can be comfortable and we can be at peace with what we're doing. See, that's why I can go and do these videos. It absolutely has no effect on me what someone else thinks. It's absolutely irrelevant because they don't pay my bills. Okay, they don't they don't pay for my lifestyle. So I'm happy to put myself out there, do videos like this, go and do meeting after meeting after meeting, go through property deal, property deal, property deal, to get a result. Because I know that at the end of all the work, there's gonna be a golden pot. 
you know, and there's going to be some reward or some materialistic rewards that are going to come out of that. And the reason why I started doing these videos and going down this path of, of sharing some of the stuff I've learned is the more I teach it to other people, the more it gets imprinted in me. As you guys are probably noticing, I, I don't have notes when I'm saying this stuff. I'm just I'm just shooting it from the hip, straight from the hip. That's why the, the videos are not really that well structured. I'm all over the place. But I'm trying to get the message across. And in this particular video, that message is persistence. So whatever it is that you guys are wanting to do with your life, you know, if, if, you, if you have a business or if you're working a job or you're going up the corporate ladder or you, uh, you're going to the gym or whatever the case may be, go hard. Most people put a half-assed effort into numerous things and they never actually do any of them any good. Like if you're going to pick something, loving your video, thanks. Uh, Are you still there? Uh, my Emma just rang me, so I thought it might have cut out. So, hey, look, the reason, um, you know, I'm doing the videos is to give some of you guys out and girls out there a reason to push forward and push hard. You know, if, you, if you're running your own business right now, if you're working a job, if, you, if you're chasing a sport, if you're doing a hobby or whatever the case may be, None of those things are going to come easy. It's going to take a level of persistence and guts to get the glory, you know? So it doesn't matter where you are in life. If you think you're going to get to some level of success by, by the easy road, you're wrong. There's no easy way. It doesn't matter what it is that you do. I remember picking up a book way back. This is when I was a livestock agent. I was down in Masterton for an elders conference, walking through this... Uh, I was walking through this mall and uh, or, or a bookshop, and uh, there was a book there called *The Four Hour Work Week* by, uh, work week by Tim Ferriss. I picked that book up at the time. I had no idea about internet stuff, um, any of the stuff that I do today. And I remember reading that book, thinking, "How the hell can you have a four hour work week?" I just didn't. Re I just didn't relate to it. So I read the book and I put it down. But years later. Um, uh, you know, I've come to realize, yes, okay, you can get to the point where you're doing a four-hour work week, but it, that doesn't just happen straight away. There's, there's got to be a grind at some point in time to make things happen. It's not going to happen overnight. And I see so many people, especially do, doing what we do, come in and get involved in what we're doing. They last five minutes because they've got no guts. They don't know what it takes to become successful, let alone in what we do, but in anything. Stickability, there's never going to be an easy way to create your success, guys. You Sooner or later, you're going to roll your sleeves up and you've got to get stuck in. You know, I, I take my hat off to, to guys like, you know, Brett Murray who's on there now. He's working away, works away out, out at sea, makes huge money out there. Man, that, see, that's not easy, but that takes guts to go out there and do that. Not many are willing, people are, are willing to go out there and spend that time offshore or out in the mines and all that rest of that stuff because... They, they want to have the lifestyle at the same time. Well, sooner or later, you're going to, depending on what it is that you want to achieve, you're going to have to do the grind. So, understand, when you get clarity around what it is that you want in your life, it's easy to get in a ute and drive two hours to go and do a meeting or go and spend a couple of months in the bush uh, working on the drill rigs like I used to do. It's easy to go and do that stuff, and it's easy to be persistent with that stuff because you know what it is that you want. And what I can say to you guys out there and girls that are watching this video, if you don't know what it is that you want right now, find it. Because I tell you what, life will go by really, really quickly. Look, I'm 32 years old. Like, where did the years go? You know, another 10 years will go just like that. And the, the sad thing or the sad reality around most people is, oh, I sit down in front of so many people, even people in their late 50s, 60s, don't even own their own house still working a job, losing their jobs, getting made redundant. You know, get, you know, there's a huge shift happening out there. So if you've got a vehicle or if you've got a, a business or you're um, pursuing a, a, up the corporate ladder or whatever the case may be, you need to be persistent and focus and, and focus and focus so that you can get the results. You know? You know that, the reason why I started doing these videos 
you know, the reason why I start doing these videos is, you know, it's crazy that I'm even doing this. I just, it's, it's out of it. But I made a decision I'm going to do these videos. Now I'll give it 110%. Every day I'll do at least one video. I can't do things half ass. If I'm going to go and do property, I've got to go hard out. If I'm going to do a networking business, I've got to go hard out. If I'm going to do these videos, I've got to go hard out. That's me. Not everyone's going to be like that. But if you have a goal or dream, it's easier to put that persistent and consistent effort in. See, if you don't have persistent, consistent effort, you'll never, ever get a result. So many of the guys I know that are around me that are close to me right now, they're... Oh, I'm not any better than any of them. And I don't think I, I don't even think like that. Look, I am honestly a basket case. I can't believe that I've, I've been able to achieve the things that I've been able to achieve. You want to go in my head every day. It's mental ping pong. But the thing is, the more I keep pushing the envelope, the more I keep doing the stuff that makes me uncomfortable, the easier it is to get to that goal. So whatever it is that you guys are choosing to do with your life, give it 110%. And you will achieve those goals and dreams that you're wanting to achieve. And we will see you at the top. You know, the, the thing is, it's exciting going through the grind. When, if, when you learn, when you learn that the, the pain is part of the process, then it becomes easy. But most people, most of you out there, or most people in the world today, can't handle the pain, the pain, and they go back into their shell like a tortoise. They go back and hide because they're worried of what the outside world's coming in and saying, saying, saying to them or saying about them. Who gives a rip what, what anyone thinks? I, I wouldn't be doing these videos if I was worried about it. So, use for all you guys who know me, you've all known me for a long time. You know, and for the people that don't know me, I'm just a kid from Invercargill in the bottom of the South Island, uneducated. But one thing I do have, and everyone around me who knows me will tell you, I am persistent and consistent with what I do. And that's the only reason I've ever had any sort of success. See, most people are spreading themselves too thin, they're doing too many things at once, and they're not actually being persistent in that field or that um, area that they need to be so if you're currently in a business or or a job or any of those things like I previously said get persistent get consistent focus on what it is that you want believe in yourself look in the mirror tell yourself that you are a winner that you can be whatever it is that you want to be stand up and and believe in yourself and we'll see you at the top it's been awesome uh, sharing with you again. I'm, I'm about to uh, head to Greenland McDonald's to catch up some guys in a meeting room there. So I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to leave you to, to your Monday evening. Go home. Write down what it is you want. Become consistent. Become persistent. Suck up the pain. And we'll see you on the beaches of the world. Catch you later.